Madam Chair, uh, on behalf of the Government of Canada, I would like to extend my appreciation to UNISDR for once again convening this important event. I will try to keep my remarks to three to four minutes as requested. Au cours des dernières années, nous avons été témoins de catastrophes naturelles de forte intensité dans plusieurs régions du monde, y incluant bien sûr le tremblement de terre et le tsunami qui ont frappé le Japon en mars dernier. Le Canada lui-même a récemment été touché par les sévères inondations. Ces événements servent à souligner qu'aucun pays n'est épargné par les catastrophes naturelles et que les mesures visant à réduire la vulnérabilité des populations face à ces désastres restent la meilleure approche à adopter. Canada welcomes the theme of this year's Global Forum, Invest Today for a Safer Tomorrow, Increased Investment in Local Action. This platform represents an opportunity to collectively assess the progress made in advancing international priorities under the Hyogo Framework for Action and to share Canadian experiences and lessons learned. <clears throat> in keeping with our support to Hyogo, Canada has strongly advocated for the integration of risk considerations into long-term sustainable development and poverty reduction strategies. We have promoted and supported initiatives such as a Caribbean Disaster Risk Management Program and the Caribbean Cat Catastrophe Risk Insurance Facility. Through these initiatives, we believe that Canada has contributed to a more effective emergency response system and bolstered existing international, regional, national, and community efforts to prepare for and respond to hazards. On a national scale, Canada's national pro platform for disaster risk reduction was officially launched in October 2010. A roundtable brought together over 70 stakeholders from across the private sector, academia, and all levels of government, Aboriginal communities, non-governmental organizations, and in individual citizens to achieve a safer and more resilient Canada. In 2010 or 2011, the Canadian platform will take place in October in Ottawa. Canadians have seen the tangible benefits of effectively integrating disaster risk reduction into community development practices through the exemplary work of communities like the District of North Vancouver, British Columbia. We are proud that North Vancouver has been nominated for the Sasakawa Award for Disaster Risk Reduction as part of the Resilient Cities Campaign. These beacons of good practice serve as both resources and reminders of the importance of community level knowledge and capabilities. In conclusion, Madam Chair, as Canada continues to make progress towards implementing the Hyogo framework, we are seeing the benefits of adopting an inclusive and participatory approach as reflected in our national platform. Canada is pleased to work with both domestic and international stakeholders to increase the safety, security, and resilience of Canadians and our international partners. Thank you, Madam.